Today, we are going to show you guys the Bronco build uh, that is going to be a sweepstakes. One of you guys are going to get it that enters. The most exciting thing, I think, for us is we're supporting our Warrior Built Foundation. It is these guys, it's a foundation where these are our wounded warriors. Uh, I mean, they literally have gone through combat and, uh, and it's been brutal for them, but, but the, uh, you know, the foundation supports all these guys and what they do is they have a shop to where they literally get all these guys together. They, they're able to fabricate, build cars and they all go race together. It's awesome. We're gonna show you guys uh, when we're actually handing this vehicle to someone, we're gonna get down there and film with these guys and we'll show you what that's about. But for now, let's just jump right into the build. Me and my pops here and uh, we're pretty excited. So we're gonna show you guys what this looks like for the first time. I'm gonna step back and uh, I'll let my pops uh, kinda explain and then I'll jump in between. But again, just a huge shout out to everyone that partnered uh, with us on this build uh, because it is pretty amazing what, what this is gonna do. So let's check it out. Dad, you ready? Yeah. All right, here so we go. Let's give you a quick rundown. This started as a Bronco, obviously, but it's loaded. It's it's the wild track's got pretty much every option that you can get on a Bronco. So we started with the best. Advanced fiberglass concepts. They came in, drew all these brand new fenders, all four corners. We got rid of the factory looking uh, flares. Which is hideous, the factory okay. flares. I mean, they work, but this thing looks, it looks so nice, you don't know what we did to it. And that was the whole idea on this. So every single person would want to help support this program. And so then we got with four wheel parts and four wheel parts, for those of you who don't know who they are, they pretty much make every part for almost every vehicle now. They're just growing crazy. They supplied full coil over suspension. So you could adjust this thing at any height. And whoever wins this, if you want to lower it, you want to raise it, you want to bring the back up, whatever you want to do, their suspension kit with their AOs. It, it's pretty cool. So this is all theirs. And um, again, it's just, it's it's a lot more beefy. If whoever gets this decides they want to go off road, they could adjust it. They could, like my dad said, you could mess with the ride height. You could stiffen it, soften it. Um, all these bumpers are theirs as well. That's what's holding the, the Smitty built winch. We want to just, in case someone, you know, wanted to take this bad boy um, out in the middle of the trees and got themselves stuck or anything, they could use the winch. But check out this hood also they machined. I mean, does that just look... So th this is all John with Advanced Fiberglass Concepts. Same exact person that uh, did all the front and rear fenders. If we didn't tell you guys that the front and rear fenders were done, you would literally think they're factory because how clean they are. The, what's hard is when you get an aftermarket fender is getting everything to line up. But these guys machine this. They start out of a huge blocks of foam and then it turns into this beautiful piece right here. And they're just, they're absolutely perfect. Like this is a, a, a part they made as well. It goes on the door. It just looks good. And then at night, you gotta have some lighting. So obviously, you know, our preferred light to go with on almost every build we do is Casey. I mean, they're pretty much second to nobody. They've been out. I think they were the ones that actually started coming out with lights. I know back in my day. <laughs> 55 years ago <laughs> yeah all our new leds especially on this i mean this thing will light up any trail or if you want to light up the freeway you might get a ticket but they're on there the great thing about the inside factory it's hard to improve on it so the only thing that we really went crazy with is all leather seating uh, road wire my buddy dave over there he just went to town on these things and all the stitching matches the dash Underneath all the perforated leather is another piece of leather that is the same color as the accent of the interior, which is kind of a tan. But once they perforate it, then you can see from an angle. It's all three-dimensional. Yeah, looking. it picks up the color. But, I mean, look at those things, front and back. It's nice. And we still have some stuff to put in here. I haven't put all the scotch mounts in there. The scotch mounts are what's going to hold uh, whoever gets this phone uh ipod whatever um gps anything like that we also did a part number badging on the dash which is kind of special for my dad and i uh just stating you know this is this is our build and um it's it's really one of a kind uh we did uh so amaze is who we're partnering with and they're the ones allowing us to even uh really do this because they're helping out a lot but we put omaze badging on it as well 
uh, the performance side of this thing, these things really do very, very well. Uh, but the sound needed change pretty bad because it just kind of almost sounds like a Prius. So <laughs> we, uh, we went with the full Gibson exhaust. So this is all bolt on. Um, it's right. We left the cat on this, uh, cause it, again, someone is going to get this and it needs to be legal for wherever they go. So we didn't go too crazy, but that's a full bolt on kit, which is pretty cool. Pops will fire it up right now. That sounds way better. Yeah. Sounds good. Yeah, it sounds good. So this all styles the biggest engine that Ford puts in him, which right now is the V6. So this baby, uh, it actually goes pretty good. Yeah, it, it doesn't. It really does. And these are uh, tires that, I mean, this is the strongest tire in the game. This is what you see with all the trophy trucks. Um, this is the KR2 from BF Goodrich. And uh, it just overall, not only is it just an incredibly strong tire, but it fits the look so well. I actually, we thought maybe we were going to do the BF Goodrich in white letters, but but the uh, the red and, and blue really just make it feel like it's just built in USA type feel, which that's how this whole thing is. And then we wrapped it with all weld wheels. And uh, this is kind of cool because they machine all this and it kind of gives it that, you know, uh, three dimensional look. But all in all, I mean, there is just so many awesome things on this. This is, uh, we teamed up with CW Wraps. They helped us design all this. Um, it's just simple. And, it, and it's almost like a Diberti blacked out edition. Well, it's open to everybody because like I go to the store and if, I'm not a big red fan. So I'll, even tools, I won't buy anything red. Yeah. You know, and everybody's got their own color that they like. So by trying to keep it neutral and open to all you that may want to have something like this. I want this. <laughs> uh, I, I was talking about that. It's like, I would like to have this. I mean, it does. It, this is probably the cleanest looking Bronco that I've seen. It's just, it's, who wouldn't want it? Someone, everyone would want this thing. I mean, yeah. I don't know how you can't like it. It's unbelievable. It's, it's really nice. It's, uh, it's our first Bronco build. And all I can say is, is we are so excited to uh, find out who's going to get this. And uh, the, we are so excited to go visit the Warrior Built Foundation at the end and, and really just show you guys um, what these guys have, have gone through for our country. I mean, it's, it's honestly, it's sad. It's, it's pretty crazy. So uh, we're going to document all that. But, you know, this is kind of just a video to show everyone what this thing is and all the work that's been put into it, and I can't wait. Any other last words, Dan? No, other than, you know, we wouldn't get to do this without the our vets. Yeah, 100%. Our military, I mean, it, I mean they've, they've sacrificed, and a lot of people don't realize that, but I mean, look at this thing. Someone right here is supporting our troops. Yeah. By entering the sweepstakes, and oh. that's exciting for me. 100%, anyone that has served, past served, um, does anything to be a part of the military. I mean, our police force, anyone that does something to support our country. Thank you guys. You guys have a blessed day. Stay tuned though for the last part of the video because it's going to show uh, how you guys could enter to get this bad boy and also have in the description. Other than that, later guys. We'll see you get to this. We teamed up with Omaze again to give one of you guys a chance to win a brand new 2021 Ford Bronco that my dad and I are about to fully build. So uh, let's just show you guys and get right into it. First look at all the parts. We got a lot. Oh yeah. Uh, we're gonna make the tires bigger. It's about 10% on diameter. ADV machine these bulge fenders and you can see just the detail. It's gonna be incredible. But you look can see how wheel. good that weld wheel looks. Two, four, six, eight lights are gonna set across the roof of the Bronco. Oh no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Casey! <laughs> Full leather. Look how rich that looks. You see that old part right there? All right guys, and here it is. Our 2021 Bronco build. So go to omaze.com slash birdie and enter for your chance to win. Taxes and shipping are all included. And best of all, every donation will support a nonprofit that is super close to my heart, the Warrior Built Foundation. Thanks for donating and good luck.